In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to create a comic book effect in Photoshop. First of all, go to the Image menu, select Adjustments, and click on the Levels option. Set the input level to 100, 1 1.00, and 250 respectively, and click on the OK button to apply the changes. Now go to the Filter menu, select Artistic, and click on the Film Grain Filter. Set the grain level to 5 points, highlight area to 5 points, intensity to 10 points, and click on the OK button to apply the filter. Duplicate the layer and rename the layer to Comic Effect. Go to the Filter menu, select Pixelate, and click on the Color Halftone Filter option. Set the Max Radius to 4 pixels. Leave the rest of the options as they are and click on the OK button to apply this filter. Now change its blending mode to darken. Go to the layer menu, move over to layer style and click on the stroke option. Change the size to 20px, position to inside, its color to F5ECE1 and click on the OK button to apply the changes made. Add a new layer, draw a rectangular shape, and open the stroke panel from the layer menu. Set its size to 5px and color to black. Move over to the Gradient Overlay tab, choose an orange to yellow gradient color, and set the angle to 0 degree. Once done, click on the OK button to apply these settings. Now add a new layer and change its name to Frame. Use the Rectangular Marquee tool from the menu and select the image. Go to the Edit menu and click on the Stroke option from the list. Set its width to 5 points, color to black, its location to center, and click on the OK button to apply it. Now add the text and you're done. 